Have you ever seen this before? Yeah, I've seen it online. Just Have you? Yeah. yeah. Does it make you hungry? Yeah, I'm really hungry actually. Just been through it. But does watching that make you hungry? It doesn't bother me. Doesn't bother you? Really? No. How just come? Just... Does it make you upset? Doesn't distress you? No? Wow. What about if they were dogs? Do you think you would react differently? No. no. Have you ever killed an animal? Yeah. You have? Yeah. What animal? Pigs, boars, rabbits. You go hunting, do you? Yeah. Yeah. When was the first time you killed an animal? How old were you? 11. That's young. Yeah. And were you taught how to kill an animal? Yeah. Yeah. By your father? Cousins. Cousins, yeah. It was in Australia. Where was it? Bosnia. Bosnia, yeah. okay. I come from Macedonia. Estonia. My family are. Yeah. yeah, my family. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. born in Bosnia. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's very much part of the culture, isn't it? It's very different over there. Very yeah, much so. I know. If you did this over there, you'd get, yeah. 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 It's funny, actually, I have seen uh, someone message me saying they're from Skopje. Yeah. And they started to do these cubes. Yeah. Yeah. You know, just to show people things. But it's just looking at it, you know, inter interests me. But yeah. See, the thing is... I've seen these online everywhere. These, yeah. These kind of things. Yeah. But do you think it's interesting that you don't kind of feel upset by it? That I guess you're kind of immune to it because you've done it from such a young age? Probably. Uh, yeah, a little bit weird, I guess. Yeah. That's how I was brought up, I guess. Maybe killing. Yeah. yeah. Killing for food. Here's a question for you. Yep. If you don't need to do it, why are we still doing this? Good question. <laughs> I'm not one to answer. Well, you are because you're, you still eat animals, right? Yeah. Yeah. So if you don't need to eat them, for survival, because we're not in that situation. We have supermarkets, we can buy yeah, many different sure. foods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are we still doing this? Why are you still eating them? I like the taste. Yeah. That's yeah. the answer you want, right? No, it's the answer I know because I what used to guys, be exactly what the same. What's the answer you guys usually get today? A taste. Everyone says that. Yeah? Bad, absolutely. You know, I ate meat, dairy, eggs my whole life. I yeah. mean, as a Macedonian, you know, yeah. everything was meat, meso. Yeah. Yeah, meso, yeah. Meso. Yeah, yeah. You know, I know that's how I was raised. Yeah, for sure. But once I knew that this is what goes on in the industry and I don't need to participate in that, I can eat plant foods instead, why would I want to hurt animals for? So is it, is it the killing of animals in general that affects you or is it the killing, like, like how they're being treated that affects well, it's you? Well, it's all animals being killed because there's no need to. You know, if it's outside of a survival situation, there's no need to harm another innocent being. Now this here, this is where 99% of the food comes from that you're buying at the supermarket, eating in the restaurants. Um, yeah. You know, this is absolutely atrocious. You'd agree with that, right? Yeah. 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 So you don't have to participate in that because every time you buy something, you're paying for it to happen. So they're not doing it for any other reason other than the consumer demanding it. So even though it might not upset you because you're a hunter and you're used to seeing this, yeah. ethically though, you know that yeah, ethically, yeah, yeah. it's not the right thing to do, right? Yeah, it's, it's not the right thing to do, but... It doesn't turn me off, it really. It doesn't turn you off. Okay, how about if you were the victim? Would that make a difference? If somebody was hunting you or putting you in that, that's a gas chamber there. Those pigs are burning from the inside out and then they'll have their heads chopped off. They're in extreme agony. If you put yourself in that situation and someone said, yeah, but you're tasty. I've always done it and I don't really, it doesn't upset me if I kill you. Do you think that would be okay for you as the victim, honestly speaking? No, oh, not really, but that's kind of, that's not a possibility because I don't think about it. How really. come? That's have we, have we ever put humans in a gas chamber before? Yep. Yeah, haven't we? We've killed humans. Yeah. We've tortured humans. For no need. So it does happen to us. It doesn't need to be that way for humans or for animals. Mm. Oh, no, I just came over to see what was on the screens. Yeah, I know. I know. But it gets you thinking, right? Yeah. I always see it on Facebook and shit. All yeah. these things. Yeah. yeah. Would you consider? Not you wouldn't consider it. No. 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 There's nothing I can say to change your mind. 
heart just came because it's interested in the, in the... I know. What does your heart videos. tell you? What does your heart tell you? Honestly? Honestly, tell Honestly? me. Honestly? Yeah. Go home and... Go home and eat dinner. And what's for dinner? Nice piece of pork. What if you can have something that tastes like pork but it's not pork? What is it? It's plants that still taste like pork. What plant? It can be soy, wheat, anything. Made of lots of different plants. It's no, the seasoning. I've tried all them, like the, the tofus and my aunties, but my aunties are vegan. Is she? Yeah. Why don't you listen to your auntie? No. Uh, I don't know. No, I'll just come over to see it. Like, I know. I know. Nothing really changed me. But it's, it's better pretty, for it's your health. pretty cool. Well, good on you guys for advocating all these things. It's better for your health? It's a lot better for your health. It's better for the environment. Have you got kids? No, 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 no. Plan on having kids? One day. One maybe. day. You want a nice world for them to grow up in? Yeah. Fresh air, clean water, yeah. land that they can grow crops on. It's not possible, mate. If this continues, it's not possible. So we've got to think about more than just our taste. We have to think about what's sustainable for this planet for the future generations. Think about your health. Leading causes of death, all linked to eating animals, heart disease, diabetes, type 2 diabetes, uh, there's, leading there's causes of cancer. There's also poor choices that lead to, to, to death, it's not just... That's the poorest, that is no, the sole... I disagree. I, I would disagree. Are you a scientist? No, I'm not. No. Okay, so the science is telling us 14 of the 15 leading causes of death are linked to eating animals. The number one killer, 17.5 million people die of heart disease. What website was that off? Yep, nutritionfacts.org. You can look that up, nutritionfacts.org. Leading cause of heart disease is saturated fat and cholesterol. Cholesterol yeah, is yeah. only found in use, animal you can products. Feel vegan as well? Yes. Okay, that's what I think. So you're not just advocating the killing of, you're advocating the whole, the whole thing. Yeah, of course. I mean, there's no need to use. What if you own? What if I own a cow? Yeah. I'm getting my own milk from a cow. Is that fine? Well, if somebody owned you and took something from your body, would that be okay? Well, wow, that's very strong. <laughs> We've done this before in history, have we not? We've had slaves. Yeah. And what did the slave owner say? I own you, I can do what I want with you. That's what we're saying about animals now. If we don't need to enslave and use animals, then why would we put them through this? If we can be happy and healthy without that? That's a good question, I can't answer. Where, are, are, these, are these all from Australian? This is all from Australian footage, yes. All of them? All of it. Standard industry practice. Doesn't matter what the farm is. They're being lowered into a gas chamber. They are fighting and screaming for their lives. And it's so painful for them. Thrashing around in there. How old were you, were you when you turned vegan? Um, I went vegetarian at 29. I went vegan at 31. I used to think that a meal was not complete without meat. Yeah. Salad and fruit, I used to say for the birds. Yeah. It's not for a human. Yeah. What did we do every celebration? Yeah. Lamb on the spit. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. I know, I know, yeah. mate. We came from the same part of the yeah. world. Yeah. I'm raised exactly the same way. Yeah. But this is f wrong. Yeah, wrong. And there's no need for it. That's the thing, there's no need for it. Yeah. So why would it? I've lost weight, got skin got better, eh? Yeah. Easy, easily done eating whole plant foods, whole grains, vegetables, fruit, nuts, seeds, legumes. I try, but I find it so boring. Oh, of course it's boring if you don't know what to eat. I don't, I don't want you to eat salad. I don't want you to eat salad. I want you to eat potatoes. I want you to eat pasta. I want you to eat very creative, beautiful food made from plants, not just a salad. I don't eat salad like that. Yeah, no, soup stews. There's lots of websites that you can go to that have very easy recipes to follow. Okay? Look. I'll take a look. I'll here's challenge 22. Look. Will you promise me? I'll, I guarantee yeah? I'll take a look. Thank yeah. you, mate. Challenge 22 yeah. is a free program. It's online. You join for 22 days. Yeah. You get a mentor, so they help you through the whole process. Yeah. They answer your questions. Mm -hmm. They help you with what to eat. They give you recipes. Any problems you have, you've got someone to talk to the whole time. All right. Okay? All right. All right. That's my promise to you. Take a look. Thank you. Thank you.